Commandos and police cordons. This is the area that I grew up. It's unbelievable to be standing here and thinking that what is pretty much a war zone, that it looks like, is what we call home. This is my aunt Zelobia, who thankfully escaped from Nakumat as the shooting was going on. You grew up too here too. How do you feel? Oh, I grew up here, and it has been sort of a petrifying experience for me. It's the first time ever encountered something like this in a very safe country, my home. I grew up here. I went to school just round the corner, and uh, this is just utterly devastating and unbelievable of what I'm seeing. It's just a really surreal experience, I think, right? It is, and when I see all this, and you know, I, I'm quite nervous, actually. Really? Coming out, yes, because... Well, you had it, a horrifying experience. Absolutely. Right? I was at Nakumet in the, in the supermarket, right powering at the back of the shelves, and these guys just passing near us, almost coming towards us, and... That was very sad that I, I won't see my family again. We're happy that she's OK. We're unhappy to see what's happening here in Nairobi. But you know, Kenyans are resilient. Oh, yes. You know, we've come through a lot. This is home. Okay? It's, it's home. We, where country. are we going to go? It's a beautiful yeah. country. And Amazing people. Yes. Love you, aunt. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.